Guys, uh, in rheumatic fever, they have asked the sequel complications they have asked many times in the exam. Okay, so just understand what it is. See, if heart is spared, everything is fine. But once heart gets involved, there can be reactivation and reoccurrences of this disease, rheumatic heart disease or rheumatic fever. Myocarditis, whenever myocardium is involved, the main problem is the conduction system of the heart gets affected. Okay, so there can be arrhythmias. Correct, no? The valves are deformed in endocarditis, you saw. Valves are deformed, especially the mitral valve. And there can be mitral valve stenosis. Okay, and uh, you may have to replace the valve surgically. So, stenosis means narrowing. Okay, so there may be requirement of the replacement of valve surgically. Else there could be cardiac failure, bacterial endocarditis. So far, we didn't see any bacteria, right? And embolism can occur. We have already told you the valve vegetation will never cause embolism. The problem is with the mural thrombi. So it's the mural, uh, you saw this, right? It is the mural uh, endocarditis which can cause problem. Okay, and the embolism can affect the lungs, brain, kidney, spleen. And there can be sudden death. Okay, so this is the sequel stigma complications. Treatment again has to be covered. These people usually will be given uh, long term treatment, antibiotics, etc. That's all we wanted to cover in this video. Let's give me a, let's just take a quick recap what we have done so far. Rheumatic fever, post streptococcal, Molecular mimicry, cross-reactivity, cross etiopathogenesis, environment factors, susceptible host, immunologic mechanism, molecular mimicry, this table is very, 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 very important. Cardiac lesions, extracardiac lesions, ash of nodules, ash of bodies, fibrinoid degeneration, Anitschkov cells, pancarditis, rheumatic valvulitis, mitral valve, fish mouth, buttonhole, mural endocarditis, McCallum's patch, don't forget that, McCallum's patch, myocarditis, intraventricular septum also can be affected. Here now we can add that uh, conduction system of heart is affected. PR interval, what will happen to the PR interval? It will be prolonged, correct? Prolonged PR interval, okay? Moving on, pericarditis, bread and butter appearance, fibrin will be there, extra cardiac lesions, polyarthritis, subcutaneous nodules, erythema, marginatum, chorea. These four will, along with the carditis, they will come as major criteria in revised Jones criteria. Then you have um, Saint Vitus dance, that is Korea minor. Then coming to diagnosis, you saw revised joints criteria. At least uh, two major criteria and one ma or one major criteria and two minor criteria in the case of a streptococcal throat infection can indicate rheumatic fever. Now we looked at the complications. Cardiac failure, bacterial endocarditis, embolism, death. And before all that, arrhythmia, re reactivation and recurrence of disease. Okay. That's all for now. See you. Bye-bye.